Hello, people around the world. Today, we are going to be watching the new mob entertainment video about 10 Lost Secrets in Poppy Playtime, Chapter 2. But before this video starts, I wouldn't mind if you just press that like button down there. Down there. Yeah, you can see it down there. It's down there. Oh. And if you like my content, press the subscribe button too. Yes. Let's get started with the video. Hey guys, it's Micah, and for Chapter 2's one year anniversary, I'm going to reveal to you 10 lost secrets from Poppy Playtime Chapter 2. Poppy we'll be discovering two. everything from deleted scenes, lost locations, to over a dozen unused characters. Keep That's in mind, lot. this list does contain major spoilers for Chapter 2, so if spoilers. you haven't played it yet, go play it, and then come back. You have been warned. Before we you start, I want to let you know we're doing a giveaway for 10 copies of Chapter 2. More information on how to win your free copy later in the video. Now, without further ado, let's get into it. Tell us secrets in Poppy Playtime Chapter 2. Number 1. Chapter 2's alternate opening. Poppy Playtime fans will remember that Chapter 2 opens with us exploring Elliot Ludwig's office and eventually yep. finding Poppy in a hidden room below. But Chapter 2 yeah. didn't always start this way. In a now deleted opening of the chapter, after freeing Poppy from her case, you wake up and are immediately greeted by the sight of Poppy peeking out behind a door. The sequence continues with you following Poppy as she slinks throughout various hallways. Following Poppy then led you back outside to where Huggy Wuggy fell in chapter 1. What followed was a 10 minute Yo, parkour sequence that where, the cat walks where into conveyor belts from chapter 1, eventually leading to a power puzzle that activated an elevator, taking you down to the game station to meet your new foe, Mommy Longlegs. Now, you're probably wondering why this never ended up in the game. There were a few reasons this yeah. alternate intro was abandoned. The first reason was chasing Poppy was just turning out too funny. The sequence went through three major iterations, starting with you straight up chasing Poppy to follow her, but that just ended up being way too funny. Okay, that, version yeah, 2 was Poppy peeking out funny. behind doorways and walls, but that was almost even funnier. In the last that's version, you see Poppy's shadow moving across the floor and walls. This version was definitely the creepiest iteration, and it's the one we ended up sticking with for quite a long time. But in the end, mm. it was abandoned for just feeling a little too cheesy. The second reason was simple. It was too long. You went through a 10 minute parkour sequence and a wild Jesus goose Christ, chase without really minutes? learning or seeing anything interesting. Which leads us to the final reason for the I scenes mean, abandoned. Right Mommy now, Longlegs had no mention or build up. So to fix these shortcomings, we completely redid the intro sequence. We first added Elliot Ludwig's office to the sequence so you had an interesting location to explore. We then changed following Poppy to Poppy talking to you to make her a relatable character instead of just a oh cheesy God, horror doll that you follow around. Then we added a scene forcing that you to watch Poppy, Poppy be kidnapped Poppy before your eyes to build up the threat My of Mommy God. Longlegs. And finally, we had you jump down a slide rather than jump down hole. catwalks for 10 minutes. In the end, these changes are why the alternate opening of Chapter 2 never saw the light of day. What is Number 2, Get out Mommy Longlegs alternate intro scene. Mommy's intro scene was one of the hardest things to get right in Chapter 2. The scene went through multiple versions of dialogue and pacing. These alternate versions, while relatively similar to the yeah, final, not be able had to a few key differences. Game. Here's the first alternate Ever. version. Even if I tried. Why? Oh my! Hello down there! Yeah, this is a lot I more different. Company. Always tells mommy when guests are on their way down. Didn't this time. It just looks goofy how the animations aren't even, like, done yet. They're just stuck in that pose. Mommy will take care of you. I don't think so. I don't. I don't think so. It's easy to get lost down here. Uh, no, it's not. Well, kinda. Oh my god, I'm really scared. Oh my god, shiver me timbers. No, you don't. So yeah, in this version of the scene, there were a few key elements missing from a storytelling standpoint. One, Mommy's introduction to the story Honestly, didn't influence anything stressful. about your current yeah, objective. Two, the player had no reason to feel threatened by Mommy Longlegs because she had no prior Exactly, exactly. So we addressed some of these issues in version two. Why, oh my. What are you doing Hello, here? Down Hello down there. people. Get, get hey, out of here. Right. Do you want it back? No, no, no. Of course not. Though hmm. mommy assumes this is something you want. Okay, yeah, this is really goofy. I do not like it at all. Well, I mean, it's just 
a really old animation, so... Why is it blipping out? Is it a known character for chapter 3? Yes. You play some games with mommy? Sure. Oh, you don't have to. Mommy can just keep little Miss Poppy if you don't want her. But I want to. Mommy already knows you love to play. Some How do you know? Lost their way oh wait. And never never found it again. But oh my god. Let that happen to you. Mommy always knows where you are. <laughs> no you don't. So this version addressed one of the big issues. Mommy now kidnaps Poppy to give the player a motive to play Mommy's games. Yeah, just but like then we realize the something. player doesn't even need Poppy. Who cares if she's kidnapped? So Mommy showing up <laughs> still didn't affect your current objective. So here's what we did to solve it. We had Poppy be the only one who knows the train code. So really now Poppy? you need her to escape. Doll. We also added that scene where Mommy comes out of nowhere and pulls Poppy down into the abyss. Problem solved. Now, Mommy steals Watch your only nice way of escape, airline. and <laughs> watching Mommy kidnap Poppy makes her introduction all the more threatening. Number three, yeah. the game station's lost designs. I Fans will remember that the game people. station features a giant mural of Mommy Longlegs, a playground for the kids, and entrances to the station's three main games. But it didn't used to be this way. The original design of the game station was absolutely massive, and featured a mural on the roof with a giant moon illuminating the station. You know, I'll, Although I'll it looked jaw-dropping, there were two major issues. It was unrealistically big and was completely empty. It didn't seem like it could have been a real functioning location for kids. The second version featured a new design yeah. for the sun and moon, and a lot more color in the room to make it more inviting for the kids who visit. However, it was still completely empty. So we went back to the drawing board, keeping in mind what a place like the game station would need to be a fully functional and realistic location. In the end, we shrunk the okay, room, time to go and a big playground for the kids go. to play in while they waited for their turn in the games, Added structural supports for realism, catwalks for Playtime Co. employees to observe the things going on, and of course, yep. added some classic Playtime Co. style branding. Number 4. Yep. Musical Memory is Lost Design Musical Memory used to have a much different aesthetic than it currently does. In the Wait, original guess, version, the walls were completely Daisy. covered in Daisy. TV screens of it's various Daisy. sizes that would display the name of the button that you're okay, supposed now, that's to press. too much, that's too much, I don't like during that. during the game used to be suspended by big mechanical arms. If this, the reason if this, this was still in the game, I wouldn't was even like that forward. at all. The aesthetic was too high-tech looking for Playtime Co. The array yep, of TVs and mechanical arms made the room feel closer to a spaceship than a toy factory. On top of that, we also you decided that there. we wanted to include an area where Mommy Longlegs could watch you play. And that just wasn't going to work in a curved room with a bunch of TVs. Number 5. Cassie Cutie Pillar Some of you may actually be aware of this one. Is Cassie it? Cutie oh Pillar was the original character that was going to be chasing you throughout the statues game. She was a giant caterpillar with a pink snout, beady eyes, and two antenna. Cassie actually appeared in the official Chapter 2 trailer it's before she was scrapped. Though Cassie was cute, we felt we had the opportunity to make the character more unique by creating an unholy combination of two different animals. So we went back to the drawing board. We spent a long time picking the right face for this new character, something that didn't feel too goofy for the statue yes, section of the too, game. That's too Eventually, much. we no. settled on the design that would become PJ Pugapillar. This was one of the later changes we made to Chapter 2, PJ as Pugapillar. we had already made a completely finished model of Cassie, complete with first simulation and realistic eyeballs, as well as various art of Cassie throughout the game having to be swapped with the new PJ art. Number 6, Daisy the Flower and 7 other characters. Daisy the Flower? This oh my is probably God. the most well-known one on the list. Oh. Very similar to Cassie Cutie Pillar, Daisy was the original character that was going to be lowering towards you during the musical memory game. She was a flower marionette suspended on strings with a very it's unsettling different. face. Like Cassie, what? Daisy also appeared briefly in the trailer. I mean, I knew that by the poster. Daisy was abandoned because we wanted a with character with more oh, theming, that's, and that's a way to alert the player different. that death was getting closer and closer. And this is yeah. where things got difficult. We went through seven completely different character concepts for the musical seven. memory toy. A monkey, a clown, a okay, fox, yeah, I like a princess, the first one the a bluebird, another bird, a ballerina, a ballerina bird, and finally, Maybe the ballerina a bunny. too. We liked the bunny because he had great theming with his symbols and clothes, as well as his symbols serving as a great audio tool as you hear him descending upon you in musical memory. After a few slight design tweaks and color variations, we finally Jesus. got the Bunzo Bunny we all know today. Daisy the Flower wasn't completely Yay, absent from Chapter 2, however, as we see various art and posters of her throughout the game, as well as a full cardboard cutout with voice lines from Daisy. Number 7, Thank Mommy you. Longlegs Alternate Designs Mommy Longlegs went through dozens of designs before she became the noodly pink maniac we all know today. 
Two of these scrap designs actually show up in Chapter 2 as old blueprints for Mommy Longlegs. Her first design was a new Get out of here. doll with button eyes. It was cute, but that was the problem. The design wasn't eerie enough. A few other things on top of that was she looked too young for her name to be Mommy. She didn't have enough resemblance to yeah. a spider for her long legs pun to make sense. And we wanted to try making oh, her a plastic toy to make her feel more unique from Huggy Wuggy. For the next designs, cursed. we really tried to push the spider look, as well as make her appearance a bit more creepy. Yeah, I do she not did like that. Like that is spider now, but too that much does so, not look good. To the point where we didn't no. think that no, 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 playtime code to create if, a toy if, like her. If, if, if this was in the game, this design didn't necessarily at this point, look like a toy I wouldn't even like it anymore. Either. The next designs but, really tried to push the creep factor oh. in the face and reel back a bit on the spider elements. This design pass is also where we came up with the idea of Mommy having limbs that could stretch. Originally, her limbs were going to extend in the form of plastic tubes, similar to the way a lightsaber toy might extend. This design was scrapped because of the challenge I of making her limbs bend I'm while also being thing. made of extending plastic tubes. The variation okay, of colors also it. made her design <laughs> feel too sporadic and complex. To solve these problems, we came up with the concept of honest, elastic plastic, good, a though. substance that Playtime co-created that can stretch like rubber but also retain its shape and position. We also simplified her color pattern and gave her a spherical waist similar to a spider's abdomen. We concepted a few hmm. alternate designs after this one with more spider-like features, however oh, the problem whoa, the from bottom, before the still persisted the that it was too spider-like and creepy for Playtime Co. to have realistically made. Number 8, okay, The yeah, Six Lost that, Toys. From the beginning of Chapter 2, we knew we wanted to have new toys present in each of the games in the game station. These became Bunzo Bunny, the Mini Huggies, and PJ Pugapillar. But before Mini those Huggies. were made, we had six different potential characters created to fill these roles. Jolly Clown, who went through a few design iterations. Lovebug, who actually appears in Chapter 2 as a rejected toy. Psydog, a robot dog toy. Sunny okay, Bunny, yeah, I do who like also that dog, appears though. as a rejected toy. Lily the Frog, a that frog like on a roller toy. skates. I don't know why they... Truck. Me. That one oh, kind of speaks for itself. Monster truck. Number 9, The Quality Control Room and the Production Room. In Chapter 2, before entering Musical Memory, we take a detour to the molding room where you create the green electric hand. In an early version of the chapter, every game you go to was going to be paired with a factory room similar to the molding room. Wackawuggy had the production room and statues had the quality control room. These rooms were never implemented into the game and were scrapped during the concept phase because they just seemed like unnecessary. Hey, get out of here. Number 10, Mommy Longlegs Death Scene. One of Chapter 2's most infamous moments is the death of Mommy Longlegs. After minutes of running away from Mommy, you're backed into a corner with no way out. But just as all hope seems lost, you pull down a lever that activates a grinder. Mommy's arm is pulled into the grinder and she desperately tries to escape. Screaming was I the only one that got a like, stomach? Like, now you wouldn't think it, but there was actually quite squished. a bit of debate behind the scenes about how Mommy should be pulled into the grinder. In the alternate version of Mommy's death, her head is actually pulled inside and grinded to a pulp leaving her lifeless lower half to fall onto the floor. Here it is. We decided to scrap this version for two reasons. One, the imagery of Mommy's upper half being dragged away would be more resonant than her lower half being dragged away. And two, Mommy's head being yeah. grinded up might have just been too gruesome to show without the game getting an M rating. So there you go. Those were 10 lost secrets in Poppy Playtime Chapter 2. And in honor of Chapter 2's anniversary, we're doing a giveaway for 10 free copies of Chapter 2 on Steam. Click the link in the description below if you want to enter. Chapter 2 is also on a huge sale on PC and mobile on these dates. So if you haven't played Chapter 2 yet, now's your chance. Make sure to like and share the video if you enjoyed what you saw. Thank you all for watching, and we'll see you in Chapter 3. In Chapter 3. Alright guys, if you liked this video, and their video of course, remember this, remember this, remember this, you gotta remember this, you gotta remember this, you gotta remember something you gotta do, you gotta do something, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta subscribe, you gotta subscribe, if you, if you subscribe, I'll give you a free hug, I'll give you three seconds, one, Two, three. Okay, I'm gonna give you a hug now. Yay! There you go. Anyways, Damien's playtime.